Good morning. We've got another week starting off Monday with strength and mobility. Hope everybody had a nice weekend. Uh, we're able to get outside, move around. It was pretty nice yesterday. We got daylight savings time, so we're here right at uh, right at sunrise, which is nice. We're gonna get going with our full body stretch. I'm gonna start standing up straight. We're gonna get one arm out. We're gonna pull back, stretching out the forearm and the wrist. <clears throat> And we'll push it down. And we'll switch. And down. All right, we'll shake it out. <clears throat> so today we will need uh, our dumbbells. And that is it. And one arm across. Switch. And we'll go behind the back. Stiffen our triceps. And switch. All right, to the side. And switch. All right, we'll stretch our necks. We're gonna pull from the opposite side towards our arm side. Remember to breathe. We're gonna hold this for about 10 seconds. And switch. All right, from there we're going to a split stance. Reach straight down. Try to keep a neutral spine, not hunched over. Shoulders forward. We're reaching for the floor. And to one side. And switch. All right, so now we'll get to the mat. Get into our butterflies. From there, we'll get one leg back. We'll lean into that back hip. And switch. Both feet out, and we'll reach. Alrighty, we'll flip over onto our chests, and we'll do back extensions. And out. All right. 
Let's get a 30 second jog, get the blood pump in, and then we'll get into circuit one where we have RDLs. Uh, what else? Reverse lunges today. And our dumbbell floor press. All right, 30 seconds. Begin. So it's that like first couple days after uh, daylight savings where it's kind of discombobulated. I wake up and I'm like, yeah, it's usually pretty bright when we start working out. Like, oh yeah, the clock changed yesterday. I didn't even realize. All right, three, two, and one. All right, take a couple seconds. Anything that still feels tight from over the weekend, feel free to stretch it out. Grab some water, whatever it is you may need to get the most out of the workout. Start your week off right. We'll get going in about 10 seconds. High shade. Bye shade. <laughs> Alrighty. So, starting off today with RDLs. Been a couple sessions since we've done them. Remember, we hold the dumbbells pronated grip, meaning palms down, <clears throat> right in front of us at our hips. And we go down, soft knees, about halfway to our calf, down our shins, I should say, trying to keep a neutral spine. And then we drive the hips forward to come up. We got 10 of these. Reverse lunges. For this one, you can hold a dumbbell on each hand. So I start here and reverse lunge. sides. Then we get to the floor for yep, our floor press. As we know by now, we start our back flat, arms at a 45 degree angle. And we go straight up for 10. Exhale at the top of the rep and squeeze your pectorals. Alrighty, take a quick 20 seconds. Second one, we got RDLs. <clears throat> 
right, reverse lunges. <laughs> High shade. Switch. Whew, got no balance on this side this morning for some reason. There we go. Done our backs for four press. Sorry, Shade. <laughs> Come here, buddy. All right, quick 20 seconds. Grab some water. Mr. Shade, <laughs> he's a good cat. All right, round three, circuit one, Monday morning. Here we go, RDLs. Lunge. Switch sides. Down our backs, final set of floor press for 10. Take about 30 seconds. Grab your water. Whatever you need. Get ready for circuit two, which we will not need the dumbbells for. We are on the mats for our mobility specific circuit. We have bird dogs, cat cows, and we're throwing bicycles in this morning, which will be our first. <clears throat> All 
Alrighty. We got our bird dogs first. As we know, start off <clears throat> hands under shoulders, knees under hips. We go opposite arm and opposite leg reach up. We're gonna do these for 30 seconds. Three, two, and one. All right, next we got cat cows, which is the same starting position. Hands under shoulders, knees under hips. We start with our head up, back straight. And as we dip our chin to our chest, our spine comes up. As we lift our head back up, we return to a neutral spine. Remember not to lean forward, not to lean back. The idea is to stay in the same position. We're only moving our head and our back. And we'll do one more. Alrighty. Next we got bicycles, which start flat on your back, shoulders on the mat, knees up, starting at 90 degree, and like you're riding a bike. We're gonna do this for 30 seconds. Ten more seconds. Three, two, one. Alrighty. Quick water break. We'll get to round two, circuit two. Round two, we got bird dogs. Opposite arm and opposite leg. Three, two, and one. All right, we got cat cows next. Head goes down, back comes up. Do one more. All right, under our backs for bicycles, thirty seconds, and begin.
five, four, three, two, and one. All right. Quick break. I'm going to finish off second two. Round three. I think I forgot to put food in this bowl. He's probably super mad at me. This cat loves to eat, and when he doesn't, he gets kind of mean. <laughs> All right. Let's finish off round three, circuit two. I got bird dogs. Set of cat cows. Tuck the chin and the back goes up. Flip on your back for our last set of bicycles. 30 seconds and begin. Three, two, and one. Alrighty. Take a few, about 30 seconds in between circuit two and circuit three. I'm gonna go feed my cat real quick. Come here, Shay. I know, I know. about that if he doesn't get fed at some point he starts like knocking plants over and doing crazy stuff so all right we're gonna need the dumbbells again for circuit three our first exercise our dumbbell lateral raises we're gonna start <clears throat> nice sturdy base dumbbells by our side holding the neutral position we're gonna lift straight out for a lateral raise. We got 10. All right, next we got calf raises. Start standing straight up. I don't think I'm gonna hit my head, but move over. And we get up on our toes. You can roll back on your heels as well. We'll do these for 30 seconds.
going about it. Turn it down, please. Three, two, and one. All right. Next, we got shoulder shrugs. It's also another new one. And typically, you want a little bit more weight for this type of exercise, but work with what you got. And again, start neutral position. We're gonna bring it up. Try to touch our shoulders to our ears. We got 10 of these. Quick break. What's that? Not working. So if you're gonna do that, can you go up to your room? Please. He's six going on fifteen, I swear. We got round two, circuit three. Starting with lateral lunges. Again, we're gonna start steady base, sturdy base. Dumbbells by our side, neutral grip. Then you go straight out. So we got calf raises, 30 seconds. Dumbbells back for shrugs. Neutral at our side. Shrug the shoulders up to your earlobes. All right. 20 second break and then we will finish up circuit three We've got our last set of lateral late raises. Followed by calf raises. Three, two, and one. All right, our last set. Shrugs. Shrug up, shoulders to your lobes for 10.
Alrighty. Quick 20, 30 seconds. Now we will get on to circuit four. Finish up Monday's edition of Strength and Mobility. Get our week started. first exercise for circuit four is going to be tricep extensions which is a, an exercise that you can do standing seated or kneeling I'm going to do kneeling because I do not want to put a hole in my ceiling or break the lamp of me so we start straight up dumbbell held like this and we dip it down our mid back. We got ten of these. All right. Next, we have one leg deadlift. Oh, single leg deadlift to knee drive. We're gonna do five per side. exercise for circuit four or reverse curls so instead of holding it supinated which is your palms up we're gonna hold the dumbbells pronated palms down and we're gonna do a curl with that grip and we got ten with 20 seconds. All right, we got tricep extensions. Single leg deadlift to knee drive. curl holding it pronated palms down and we curl for 10 Alrighty, last 20 second break, and we finish up circuit four and strength and mobility as a whole for Monday. We are already halfway through March, which is crazy. Whew. March 13th. I like to think spring is, you know, 
days, short weeks away. But if you live here in Massachusetts, work at Bedford, you know that we're about to get a good chunk of snow coming in tonight into tomorrow. <clears throat> Welcome to New England, right? All right. We got tricep extensions. Single leg deadlift to knee drive. All right, we got our last set of reverse curls, and then we'll get our cool down and get on with our Mondays. Have a quick drink. We'll get to our cool down stretch. We'll start down kneeling on the mat. And we're just gonna do some big arm circles. Forwards. And reverse going back. All right. That's what I'll do. A half kneeling split stance. Sit into that back hip. We'll stretch in the groin. And switch. Butterflies. All right, we'll get on our backs. Go knee to the chest. Push the leg out, get a little bit more stretch of the hip and the groin as well. Switch. And out. And both knees. Finish us off. All right, that is going to do it for our Monday edition of Strength and Mobility. 
I hope everybody had a great weekend, gets their week off to a good start. Anybody on the East Coast who's going to be dealing with the storm, stay safe, and I will see you on Friday.